And how do you get to be a nationally recognized top karate professional? Well, I'll tell you one thing. It takes a lifetime of dedication. Let's take a quick look at Michael's background. Michael's career is no exception because it started over 28 years ago in Washington, D.C. And as a competitor, Michael earned 50 international and regional championships in fighting and in forms and in team fighting and even in demonstrations and breaking competitions. While he was in Washington, Michael taught at 30 locations, supervised over 3,000 students. And as a member of the Tang Sudo Association, he was a chief instructor to over 300 black belts. Michael has trained over 100 national competitors. Now that's a lot of people in point fighting. And also he got into the realm of full contact fighting and set some of the standards in full contact as well as the standards for breaking competitions and was nationally seated in several of the championship events all over the United States. As coach and the lead fighter for the Tang Sudo Karate Association, Michael led an undefeated team all over the country and even to the Orient. But not only has Michael worked with men, he's been the coach and trainer for some of the finest women competitors in America as well as junior black belts. And in his career, he's earned many prestigious awards like the YMCA Service to Youth Citation, which is given to just one person every year as a benchmark of excellence for working with children. In addition to karate competitors, Michael has had the pleasure of working with celebrities and actors and also has been selected to work with various units within the armed services, police departments, Secret Service, U.S. Embassy, and even correctional facility personnel. Michael has appeared on NBC's Today Show, ABC's Wide World of Sports, and was selected by Martial Arts Who's Who, which is a very prestigious award. He's also been featured in U.S. News and World Report and some other national magazines, news magazines, as well as many martial arts publications, including Black Belt Magazine, Karate Illustrated, and many others. Yeah, it takes a lot of effort, and it takes a lifetime of dedication, but as far as we're concerned, it really pays off because Michael Kenney is tops.